I told you it was going to happen and it's happening right now. Now, I don't have a crystal ball. If I did, I would be in the Bahamas and you wouldn't be hearing from me. But interest rates, they are coming down. They're not plummeting. And I did not say that they were going to plummet. I said that they were going to come down slowly. So behind me, you see the graph. In the summer of 2022, we had high interest rates. Duh, we all knew that. But slowly, they've been coming down, just like I said that they were. Why are they coming down? Well, I'm going to give you a little teaser right now. In a couple weeks, Sean Kramer and I, we are going to sit down and we're going to go over the myths of interest rates and what affects them. Because there's a lot of a lot of people think they know why they go up and down, but they're wrong. The most popular is the Fed rate. Feds raise the rate, interest rates go up. Not true. What happened the last couple of times when the Feds raised the rate? Interest rates went down. So what are we looking at to see where interest rates are going, up or down? We like to look at MBSs, mortgage-backed securities. And right now they're trading higher and we're seeing the interest rates go down. Now the number one cause for the fluctuation of mortgage rates is going to be inflation. And think of it like this. Inflation is at 8%. Where do the investors need to set their rate just to break even? Just to break even at 8%. If they want to make money, they got to go above where inflation's at. Now that inflation's getting under control, all the reports are showing that, Inflation's coming down. So what's rates doing? They're following inflation. Pull up a map of mortgage rates and inflation over the course of time, and you'll see that they parallel each other. So what does this mean for buyers? You're going to get a more affordable house. But be cautious because there's going to be more people coming, more buyers coming into the market. There's going to be competition again. I'm not saying it's going to be like covid a lot of those cash buyers they bought, a lot of those buyers that had a lot of money that could put down 20% and go 100000 over asking price, a lot of those guys, they're out of the market. But there's still going to be competition. So sellers, if you're on the market, just stay calm. It's going to be fine. We are seeing more foot traffic on the listings. We're seeing more offers being wrote up. We're seeing more pendings. So just hang tight, be patient. Now, if you're not on the market and you wanna get on the market, I would wait till mid-March, late March, maybe the beginning of May, because interest rates, they're gonna to continue to improve to make housing more affordable. You're gonna get more buyers in the pool, so just hang tight. All right, guys, stay tuned on, I think it's 123 of 23 is when Sean and I are doing that video. It's going to be super knowledgeable, a lot of good information in there. So stay tuned and watch out for that video.